What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of my Pokemon Zeta Nuzlocke. In the last episode we arrived in this town which is Agaziz town or something like that. And then we entered the Psychic Temple which Team Asgard seems to have taken over. So today we're going to carry on exploring it and I guess we're going to go down first since... Does this just lead us? Yeah, down to there. Okay, that's cool. Let's lead up, go up then I guess. Uh, go on the left. I'm guessing it leads to the same, yeah, same room. So we just got to clear the room. I don't like this tower very much but I have to endure it for my raise. All about money for Team Asgard, it would seem. Or maybe world domination, everything. They like money, though. But yes, hopefully you guys are doing quite well today. I'm not too bad myself. Um, you can answer the question of the on the on, so shown on screen now, if you want to, of course. And I guess, yeah, just do that. If you would like to, of course. Okay, let's go for the crunch. It's going to do over half, which is quite nice. And that's Farrett defeated. Looker is powerful. Looker is pretty darn powerful. It's a girl, and it's called Looker, but I don't really care. I should call it Looker with a A and 7 ER. That might have worked a bit better. Okay, so what I can do here is go further up. Does this go anywhere in particular, or a dead end? Brilliant. Let's guess where. Yeah, that's where we have to go, it would seem. So, let's go down here, and let's go down here. Yes, we shall indeed. And battle these members of Team Asgard. Eh, there we are. Truth be told, I only joined Team Hascar for the health benefits. See, all about health benefits, money, everything. Do they give you like free health insurance or something? Something like that, I don't, I don't quite know. Do they? I guess they do, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Can't use crunch here, so cut it is. Faint attack, okay, we can take those. Cut for days, cut for day guys. No, don't cut for days, please don't. No, okay, that came out wrong. Again, no, okay, I'm gonna shut up now. Almost level 28 for Looker 2. No, my Pokemon, indeed. You, you're that nasty kid from Omega Town. Oh, but Omega Town, Omega Town sounds like Omega Town. Whoa! Hashtag home confirmed. <laughs> Weavile, he's got a Weavile. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna switch here. I'm gonna go into Aura because if it hits us with an Ice type, we resist that. If it hits us with a uh, Dark type, we resist that. So, is all good. Nasty plot. Raising your special attack. Okay, integration, yeah, integration. Not gonna use it because Brick Break's four times effective, so. A special Weavile, never seen that before. Speed fell, okay, uh, Brick Break's just gonna smack you out in one, so that's good game there, Weavile. Uh, good game indeed. <laughs> I don't know. Look leveled up, and Aura's almost gonna, le gonna level up too. Yes. We still are trying to use integration, our custom move. Let's send out Sturds, because Sturds has that move as well as Aura, because they're both physical attackers, so that's quite nice. Nice coverage move. Repel War off, we should use another Repel. You, stay out of here. Team Asgard is training, looking for red Pokemon. Okay, so they haven't really taken over the tower, they're just training in the tower, I guess. Or just in the tower in general. Curlia, we can, we can destroy this thing. We can destroy this thing. Let's go for, not integration, because we can get stabbed from it. Yeah, for the Rock Blast. Integration is going to be helpful every now and again, not not all the time. Every now and again when you know, there's a grass type come out or something like that. Should be pretty good. And we defeated Team Asgard. Dang! Ah, this would happen again? I'm pretty sure it will, to be honest, if you're around again. What's this guy doing up here? Oh, okay, fine. I said, move out of the way! Sir, I'm afraid I cannot. It's against protocol. A dangerous Pokemon has taken Roost up there. It could be hazardous and life-threatening. You would yet that's what Team Asgard is here for. Now we out of the way or are we forced to hurt you? Sir, I cannot. It will be against the... Move out of the way! Loki, just let the poor guard be, alright? So Loki, return to Agassiz at last. Didn't you visit the gym? Didn't visit the gym. Why? Scared of an old friend? Jonathan, it's been a while. How's that criminal charge faring? I thought your sentence lasts at least another two years. They let me out early for good behaviour. They knew deep down that it wasn't me who killed that family. Oh right, how old was that kid again? Six. And on his birthday too. What a shame. Shut up! I'll battle you right here, right now! I think not, and seeing as this foolish guard is standing in Team Asgard's way, I'll be taking my leave. I'll be sure to warn your parole officer about you threatening people. Ta-da! Oh, ta-da! The dirty Ryan line b Oh, I'm sorry you had to hear all that. It's a feud that goes back a long way. Hey kid, can you help me relieve some stress? You look like a tough battler. Come help me out in my gym, alright? See if you can beat me. I need to loosen up. See you then if you're up to it. So we can still battle this guy because he's still here. No, you'll never reach the top! Technically we just did, so yeah. <laughs> No idea why he's not a uh, sort of, he's sort of out of the way, you don't have to battle him. But we did, or we are going to anyway, because it's awesome and we shall. Rock Blast time, Confuse Ray, ugh, ugh, Confuse Ray. Sturds, use Rock Blast, destroy that thing. Yes, powerful, over half damage, taking out the go about with ease. Not bad, not bad at all my friends. 
And leveled up to level 28. Yes, Sturridge. Sturridge is getting powerful. My whole team is getting pretty powerful. Even look at really. Okay, let's send Aura out the front. Can't use strength fail, obviously. Send Aura out, and Aura can do some work with integration and whatnot. Okay. I'm sorry, there's some uncontrollable vermin up there. I'm afraid I can't let you visit the top floor. Uncontrollable vermin, that's a powerful, mischievous Pokemon. Hmm, interesting. Team Asgard's still here, they just haven't left yet. They're like, we're gonna hang around for a bit longer, you know, don't mind us. You defeated our leader, we didn't, well, we didn't defeat the leader technically, so. But next thing up, next thing up, next thing up next is actually the gym. We shall not use another repel, no. Uh, we're gonna pop over to the Pokemon Center, heal up, and then we'll go into the gym and get a battle going on. Obviously, where it's a rock type gym, I'm pretty sure, so Lucari is gonna sweep through this thing, so is Rotom Wash. Uh, so is, I guess, Sturridge as well, sort of. Um, who else is gonna get through it pretty well? Who knows? We'll see. Okay, hello, you. Hey, champion, the making this is Agatha's Town Gym. Jonathan and Lily is rock type Pokemon. That means you should be careful not to use flying, fire flying, bug or ice types. There's a lot of different types. The be best types to beat rock types are fighting types, steel types, water type, rock bleh, types. Best of luck to you, future champ. I'm gonna put the uh, the glasses on because otherwise it's gonna get annoying. Go goggles, that's the one. Yes. Oh, but there are pathways though. Interesting. Ha! You're miles away from Jonathan. That's fine with me though. I want to train some more. What level are you though, Hiker Timothy? Lunatone. Okay, that kind of screws over our plan a bit. <laughs> uh, but we can go for a nice clean brick break still and still do. Majority damage there. Rock polish. Okay, interesting. Haven't got. Uh, oh, damn you. Haven't got a quick attack anymore, but not like we'd use that anyway, because it wouldn't be killed it. But that's good. Lunatone's out of the way. I'm guessing Soul Rock might be up next. Level 28 for Aura, though. That's pretty darn decent. Soul Rock's coming out, so I'm going to go and switch into. I'm going to go to Horny, because Horny has not got any uh, ground type moves, which was just what I was about to say. It has ground type moves. But, uh, nah. Let's go for that clean rock blast. Rock polishing again. Okay, even though you're faster anyway. <laughs> uh, let's see how much damage we're going to get done here. Oh, down to half. Hit two times. Okay, one was a crit, obviously, but yeah. Psy Wave is a really weird move. I don't like it because it doesn't do any damage. Or its damage set is really weird. Uh, only two times again. Really being unlucky right now. But rock polish again, which means we can give rock blast you out of here. You're blasting off again like Team Rocket, of course. We're blasting off again. I don't quite know. Out comes Graveler. Okay, I guess I should have Graveler. Uh, Holutria. Yeah. Hol obviously, Holutria is going to get into this gym too, because it is a nice, clean fighting type. Only person needs to level up is Horny. Uh, it's, yeah, Horny. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to Plasma anyway, because Plasma is nice and, and immune to those ground type moves. Plus, it has Hydro Pump, which is going to wreck lives. Hydro Pump. Yes. Goodbye, Graveler. Absolutely destroyed you. We're get Our team is absolutely. Just, oh, it's powering up right now, guys. I'm liking this scene, to be fair. Ah, oh, no fair. Obviously, we have two fighting types, but I didn't mind too much about that. Map's sort of messing up again, and we have to manage to um, get the sandstorm back up again, which is a bit weird, but well. Oh, okay, so we push the rock, and then we can climb over the rock. Oh, we can walk over it, rather. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, I guess I'm going to put Horny out front. Should be able to manage itself with that amount of health points. See how we do. Let's go. All fossil Pokemon are rock type, but not all rock type Pokemon are fossils. Indeed. Thank you for that lovely bit of insightful information there, Hiker Folk Reef. Is that. No, Folk Reach. That's something off from Skyrim. Ah, <laughs> oh, great. So this is a water type Pokemon. Sandstorm's raging. I should really get rid of the Sandstorm to be fair. Uh, water type Pokemon. So I'm going to go into Looker here. Don't know why. Just feel like it. Looker's pretty cool right now. Yep, absorb. Okay. Water type Pokemon uses grass type moves. Seems legit. <laughs> sandstorm, yeah, we need to get rid of the sandstorm. We do need to get rid of it. Crunching up, because that's gonna be doing neutral. Didn't get defense drop, but we should still be able to take it out next turn. Sandstorm again. I should really got put the go go, go go back on. Didn't realise that it puts or didn't remember that it puts the sandstorm back up. Mud shot's gonna lower my speed. We don't have quick attack, however, but we do have cut, so I guess I'm gonna use cut here. Don't know why, just feel like using cut. Mud shot, speed fell again, and there's the cut, and Kabuto's been defeated. That's all good. It's OG. Omeni T. Okay. Another rock water type. 
Wait, yeah. Yeah, they're both rotten water types from Generation 1. Just realised that, actually. Just legit. Legit. Just just then. Just... Oh, God. <laughs> okay, Holucha. Out you come. Doing power. Being powerful, Holucha. Amenity. Let's go for the... Okay, buff it, obviously. Let's go for the nice, clean flying press. Super effective, nurse. Oh, didn't take out on one. That's a bit of a bummer. Water gun. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be absolutely fine. Flying press again. I think flying press has got 100% accuracy, doesn't it? If it doesn't, it's a bit of a problem because it's not that accurate, but oh well. In comes Lilip, which is a rock grass type Pokemon, so uh, I'm going to go to Aura for this. I don't just, just choosing Pokemon, really. Aura can power up because it is a boss. Let's go for it. If only they learn power up punch, that'd be quite nice. Plus, it's a rock type, so it, um, steel type rather, not a rock type, I'm thinking of steel type, so it's immune to the sandstorm, even though we get rid of it now. Level, tw ooh, almost level 29. My fossils were defeated. Indeed they were, my friend. My enemy, whatever. Okay, I need to, uh, yeah, keep horny out front still. Just need to go up here and push this rock down. Yes, not bad. Uh, I need to go up here first and push this rock up. And then push this rock across. Push this rock across. Uh, can't go anywhere there until we've pushed that rock across. So I guess that's a shortcut up to the boss, uh, up to the gym leader rather, not the boss. What I'm thinking of. So yeah, have to push this one up here first. May as well push this one here while we're at it. Okay, one more battle to do before the gym leader. So that's fair enough. Have to go all the way around here. It would seem. Uh, maybe yes to get the last one. I've been training for ages my rock Pokemon. Well, I'd be worried if there were any other type of Pokemon if you're in a rock type gym, being one of the gym trainers. Hiker Solitude. They've got to be based off of um, towns or cities from Skyrim. Solitude, Folk Reef. I forgot what the other first one was called, but it sounds about right. Okay, Rock Blast is not going to do anything anymore, so <laughs> we may as well just switch out after this. Yeah, not doing anything. Three times, four times. Not bad. Four time hit isn't too bad. Sandstorm, didn't get rid of the sandstorm, god damn it, I forgot again. I'm gonna go into Plasma, who's gonna resist any steel time moves they throw, be immune to any ground time moves, and also have Hydro Pump, and it's a special attacker too. Swagger, which is brilliant because as I said, I'm a special attacker, so I'm basically just confused. Sandstorm rages, buffeted by the sandstorm. Uh, yeah, I guess we just go with the Hydro Pump if we break through the confusion. We did not. God damn it. Powerful. Iron defense is not going to help you if I manage to get an attack off. Because we're powerful. Come on, Plasma. We can do this. Come on, Plasma. Yes. Not bad. If it missed the Hydro Pump, then it'd be like, oh, god damn it. <laughs> plasma should level up there. Maybe. Horny leveled up there, so that's good. Okay, Plasma didn't quite level up. Onyx is coming out. I'm going to go into Aura for this. Just, I feel like Aura is going to have the power to take it out. Just feel like it, even though it's probably got Earthquake or something, which will be totally screwing us over, but oh well. And it's a powerful Onyx too, level 28. Damn. Brick Break, over half, or oh, even 90% of that. Rock Polish, oh, okay, you're most likely going to be faster than me now, so that's fair enough. Yes, you are, but you're going to use Rock Polish again, which is completely useless, so good game, Onyx, good game. <laughs> We're just going to completely destroy you there. And Aura's going to level to level 29. 900 experience because that lucky egg. Bone Rush, yes, but definitely learning Bone Rush. Get rid of Force Palm. Get a nice coverage move uh, against any ground type Pokemon, fire types, I guess. Um, and whatever else is weak to ground type moves. <laughs> Aerodactyl's last out, so I'm going to go into. I'm going to go to Stir to this, who has Rock Blast, uh, who's going to be super effective, which is going to be super effective against that Aerodactyl there. So that's quite nice. Aerodactyl might have Earthquake, I suppose, but we'll, we'll, we'll deal with it. Rock Blast it. Supersonic. Come on, Aerodactyl. Really? Aerodactyl really at Supersonic? What? Come on, Sturds. Yes. Yes, Sturds. Oh, the power is here. And the triple hit is going to take out the Aerodactyl. Good game. Good game. Hiker Solitude defeated. Unbelievable. They lost. And we just push this last block down. Going to head back, though, and heal up, first of all because our team is sort of getting lowish on health points, so we'll head back and heal up first. Then we'll get rid of the Sandstorm for that gym battle, because I don't really want the Sandstorm up during the gym battle, especially if this Pokemon has Sand Veil or Sand Force or something, because that would be absolutely suckish. Plus, obviously, some of my team would take damage from it too, which is not nice. 
Okay, let's do it. Obviously, Sandstorm boosts the special defense of some Pokemon. I mean, like, Rock, Ground, Steel-type Pokemons, I'm pretty sure. Please don't. Okay, hasn't reset. That's nice. I mean, you can go all the way up here. All the way... Uh, yeah, I think up here. I think, yes, this is the one. This is the way. Yes. It's got a Lava Tar as his ace, it would seem. I'm going to use the go Goals finally. Who should we stop? Oh, shit, okay. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. Oh, you were the person I saw earlier in the tower. Don't ask me about what Loki said. I don't want to talk about it. You're here to battle, right? Then bring it on. Let's battle. Gym leader. Jonathan. He's got a nice rock in his hands. So that's fair enough. <laughs> yep, he's holding his rock like, I got a rock. Yeah. <laughs> Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn versus Rhyhorn. So that's fair enough. His rock, my horror is more powerful though. So yeah, that's good. Oh shit, ground type resistor, of course. If he has a ground type, I'm going to be annoyed. Because mine doesn't. <laughs> Horn attack, okay. It's going to be Battle of the Resistances here, since we can't do anything against each other. Just to work them down slowly. Obviously, it's going to activate any potions he may have, but I don't mind too much. Scary Face is going to lower my speed, so I'm going to be slower than him now, but I don't mind, as I said. Lowering my speed again, okay. Rock, and bla rock Blast and again. Down to half health, yes. Finally, and it took us like three turns, four turns, something like that. Super Potion, yep, there's the potions. That's fair enough. Might be worth using a Tail Whip or two just to work their defense down. So, especially if he has some more Super Potions, would be nice. Four times that time. Tail Whip it. Fury Attack is going to do, yeah, one damage per time. Maximum of five times. Okay, or well, sometimes two damage, but yeah. Three times. Tail Whip it. Rhyhorn's going to, you know, defense fall. Stomp. Don't make me flinch, please. I didn't flinch, that's nice. Just going to keep Tail Whipping for a bit. Horn Attack again does absolutely nothing. Tail up again. Obviously we're switching Horny out after we defeated this thing because our speed has been lowered four times. So yeah, we're not staying in here. It's good though. Okay, come on, come on, Rock Blast, come through. How much damage you can do this time? Not even bad, a bit more damage than usual. A bit more damage than before. Okay, that's fair enough. Critical hit there. Should be able to take them out from where they are now. Unless, yep, they got a Hyper Potion and a Super Potion. Okay. Good thing I did go for the Tail Whips then. Because that's going to allow us to make it, e it's gonna make it easier for us to get it down to lower health points again. Another crit. And we get some more damage. Another crit is what? Two crits in a row. Plus a crit last time. We're getting powerful today, guys. We're getting the hacks. The hacks. A real Rock Blast it. And Rhyhorn is gone. Yes. One down. Free to go, I think. No idea what's coming out next. Probably a ground type. Graveler, yep. Gonna go into Rotom for this one because it has the powerful Hydro Pump, which is four times effective, and that's gonna wreck Graveler up. As we saw on Graveler just now, actually. <laughs> if it has Sturdy, it's no big deal, really. Um, Hydro Pump's gonna miss, though, which kinda sucks, but oh well. It's got Rollout. Okay. Obviously, Rollout's gonna power up a bit. I'm guessing. Yep, Sturdy. Okay, it's gonna use Rollout again, but that's gonna be alright because it's not gonna do enough to take us out and we're uproar because only got one health point left not going to risk missing a hydro pump it takes some more damage from that rollout and that's the graveler gone yeah level 29 for plasma too plasma wants to learn ominous wind it's not a rock type it's not a ghost type anymore but ominous wind is pretty good so i'm gonna get rid of flash we can always reteach flash if we need to because it's just a tm onyx is coming out too i'm not going to go to um i'm going to go to whole lucha for this one because I feel like it. I don't want to stay in with Plasma because Plasma's already almost at half health. So, yeah. Hulucha, come through. Onyx. Let's go for that clean flying press. Yes. Okay. How much was it going to go for? Smackdown. Okay. Smack us down to the ground, I'm pretty sure. Because it's going to switch out and go into Lavatar, which is rock ground. Uh, okay. Just going to take a flying press there. Going to do. Just take it out in one. Fair enough, Hulucha. You're pretty powerful. Um, <laughs> boosted experience, and in comes the Onyx. So we're back to square one, really, because nothing changed. I won't give up. Not while I still have fight left in me. Yeah, that fight's not going to be left in me for much longer, dude. Rock throw. It's going to be neutral because of our nice flying, fighting splits and cancel out and whatnot. So that's good. And that's Onyx gone. And Hollage level to number 29. Woo! Damn, that was awesome, he says. Wow, this is just a just a cap on a great day. Take this as a, as a as a reward. The diamond badge. This badge that uses lets you use the HM cut outside of battle. This should grant you access to the Fianga City Gym. And here, take this too. Team 80 Rock Slide. Yes, powerful. Gonna teach it to my Pokemon. 
Powerful, Rock Slide, because I have loads of Rock-type Pokemon. <laughs> Rock Slide, yes, let's get this thing on him. On first off, Horny, then second off, Sturds, and maybe Horlucha as well, just to get some more coverage moves. Uh, so it's 25, this is 75, so it's at least, it's three or more. Uh, I'm going to get rid of Horn Attack is 65, but Horn Attack, yeah. May as well get rid of Horn Attack, because Horn Attack and Stomp do the same damage, so yeah, that's fair enough. So we have two moves that can flinch there on Horny, so that's quite nice. Let's teach this to our Sturds too. Might get rid of Rock Blast on Sturds. Uh, you know, just to... Because, you know, it's it's Rock Blast. It's the same accuracy, just a higher power. It's a guaranteed three hits or more, whereas sometimes you just get two hits. Sturds have got Rock Blast and learnt Rock Slide. Not going to teach to anyone else another thing right now. Because I like how it is at the, mo at the moment. Okay, who's not level 29? Uh, Looker, you're up front again. Like you were at the start of the episode. So we have we can have now have the ability to use cut outside of battle, which means we can finally go and cut all those trees we've been seeing everywhere and see what sort of I think we can go into that mansion now, can't we? Because that was a hidden by cut, if I'm correct. I'm not sure. Uh, let's heal up and then we'll head back up towards Kariba Town, because I'm pretty sure it's a dead end here. Or we'll check the town map in a second. Thank you for waiting, that's completely fine. Or the poker gear rather than town map. Map. Uh, where are we at now? We are here, Kariba Town. On the way, I exist town. Okay, we can go further south, but I'm not sure if we can or not. We'll check it out. Uh, but I'm pretty sure we're we're stuck. And we're not allowed to go. We have to go back up and beat Fianga first. Um, uh, there's no exit here at least, so I don't quite know. No exit, so I guess there's no way out. I guess you have to find some. I don't know. Something else we have to do first before we can go down further down south. So let's head back up to the previous routes and cut some trees down, I guess. See what's behind them as well. Route 308.5, casually naming a route with, with half on it. I don't quite know, but I'm fine with that. And there we are, back up to here. What was it? Yeah, sign of door says trick house, but the door is locked. That's the trick house, so we might come back for that. I don't know. There's a cut tree here, though. So, oh, wild Pokemon, brilliant. What have we got? A Hippopotas. Not bad. Run away from the sting. Sandstorm up to a sandstorm. Great. Loads of sandstorms. I think we had enough of sandstorms now, guys, haven't we? Use the machete because we don't need uh, to actually use cut anymore. And there's a nice clean ultra ball for us. Yeah, because we don't actually need cut on a thingy. What's his name? Watchog. Into Kariba Town. Is there a cut trip here? No, it's that guy that gave us a TM, I'm pretty sure. I'm not quite sure what it was. But we'll keep heading up north because that's all we can do. There was no... Uh, I'm going to need to repel though, because there's a lot of grass on this route, it gets annoying. From what I remember, oops, oh, there was no um, no cut trees on this route, but I can always check, of course. Chickity check it, nothing there, nothing there, and nothing over there, okay. There might be something over to the left, to the right here, rather. Um, nope, nothing there, okay. All checked out, and we'll go and head up into Fianga City, finally. So we can battle another gym. I don't think I'm battle the gym this episode though. I'm going to use all the, the cut everywhere. Uh, where else we, could we not get to? I guess I'm going to go back and check out that uh, that haunted house is what I'm going to call it. Another repel needs to be used here. Thank you. Almost run out of repels again. Bump, bump, bump. Da, 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 da. Helping over here. Let's go around here. Your dolly may be able to push us around. But we just use strength instead. Don't know why it uses a machete. But then, it doesn't use the, 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 the dolly. Unless it does use the dolly, and I don't know. It's weird. Okay. Uh, now, there's a bit we couldn't get through here because of Rock Smash. I, I know that. But obviously, we don't have access to Rock Smash yet, still. Repel War Off. Yep, use another one of those. I haven't got Flash anymore, so I'm just going to have to last through this. Yeah, there's the Rock Smash bit. But I believe uh, if we go back to the previous town... Or, you know, between the two previous towns, there is a bit where we need to use cut. Nothing in this city uh, where we need cut, is there? Just a town. In oh, I see cut. Yes, cut trees. Where the hell is this? No, we won't use repel because it's going to be a new area. Holy hell, where is this? Does it tell me in the Poké Gear? Map? Uh, no. Onega Town, not the Safari Zone, though. Hmm. Seems like a special area, but what for? Who knows? I'm guessing it looks like a legendary area, but I don't know. Get out of there. 
and we shall then head back to where we were planning to go in the first place and use that cut there. I want to see what's inside that house, really. I think I think it's cut we needed. I'm not quite sure, though. We shall find out, won't we? I'm going to have to hop down, though, because that's just how we do it. And we'll pop up. Hop down, pop up. Into here, which is Midnight Way. I'm going to hold off on the... Okay. I say hold off on repels, and then it gets annoying straight away, so... I'm pretty sure this is where we caught Sturd, so that's quite nice. Sturd's going back to his home, or her home. No, it's his. Yeah, it is him. Okay, let's use this repel then. Last repel we have, so... Gonna have to deal with the uh, wild Pokemon on the way back, if, of course, if I end the video up there. Or if I don't end the video up there, I'm sorry. Okie dokie. And out here, which is in the Midnight Mansion extension. How to get to the center again? Uh, who, know, who knows? I'm pretty sure this is the right way. Oh, uh, the guards here. Let you through? Ha! Huh. I don't let you through if Odin himself gets defeated. So this is a Team Asgard base, so I guess we have to defeat Team Asgard somewhere um, to actually, you know, get into this house, which is a bit of a bummer. So cut has no use here, but in the next episode, guys, we'll head back over to Fianga City, or I'll do it off-screen anyway, and I guess we'll challenge the next gym in Fianga City, and I guess we'll see if we can beat them or not. So guys, I thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to smash that like button and leave the question of the day down below, and I guess I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Uh, goodbye, my friends.